Hey friends, I'm going to quickly show you how to add uh, a member's name into the HTML into uh, your Squarespace website. You can see it's saying, hi Will, glad you're here, and it's pulling that name Will from my member space account, Will. So it will display anyone's name uh, who has logged in. So first, uh, I wrote an article about it over here, and so that's where I'm going to take all my code from. And it walks you through, if you'd rather read, go read that. Um, it walks you through a little few more things, but I'm going to copy this, add a custom code block to your uh, with your HTML. I'm going to copy this and add it in to the page that I want it. And you'll see I've already added it in, but I'll just jump in, hit edit, code block, there it is, paste that in. Uh, it should look like that, and hit apply. And it'll be good, hit save. Um, and again, I've already added this, so I'm going to edit this out, and I'll show you how to get in there. You might already know how to jump in there. But I went into Settings, Advanced, Code Injection, and slid down here to the footer. Uh, and you'll see I already have Member Space installed. If you don't have Member Space installed, this won't work. Uh, but next, I'm going to come down, grab this script. It's some JavaScript. Uh, paste it into the footer and hit save and now it pops it in. Hi Will, glad you're here. That's awesome, but we want it to be a little bit bigger uh, so I'm going to go into the code and hit actually instead of a div we want this to be maybe an h2 element. That's what I initially had it as and save that and sometimes it won't refresh over here, so what I do is I open up a separate uh, hidden incognito mode on uh, Google Chrome, refresh it there, see if it's actually working, and boom. So look, that's we're good. We're golden. Uh, all right, so that's it. If you want more of this, sign up for my newsletter. Send me an email if you have any questions. Let me know.